Hey guys, this is Haley from OneOnRabbits.com and in today's video, I'm going to be talking all about weekly rabbit care. So something you're going to have to do on a weekly basis is buy fresh veggies for your bunny. I personally go one to two times a week because sometimes my veggies just don't stay fresh for a week long. So I kind of find myself going every like five days versus like every seven days. But it really depends on like what veggies you're buying and how long they stay fresh and how much your rabbit eats. The next thing you're gonna have to do is clean up after your bunny. So a lot of the times once a week I'll do a major clean where I vacuum everything, I change the litter boxes, I clean the litter boxes, I refill all of their hay boxes. I basically take everything and just clean it all. Rabbits can be quite messy, but a lot of the times it's like the hay that is the messiest. So vacuuming at least once a week is definitely a must. I also spot clean throughout the week. I don't have a set day on like how often I do this. I literally just go by how messy the bunnies are and when I feel like it needs to be spot cleaned. For spot cleaning, I kind of just vacuum up any hay that's around and then like spot clean their litter boxes, which for that I just take out the wet stuff and all the hay out of the litter box and mix it around and that's basically all I do. Another good thing to do about once a week is switch out your rabbit's toys. This just helps your rabbit not get bored with the toys they have and it creates a lot more enrichment for them. By swapping the toys out, it makes the old toys seem like they're new because they haven't seen them in a while. If you guys are ever looking for new or fun toys, don't forget that I do have a shop on 101rabbits.com so you can go ahead and check that out if you guys are interested. So another thing you might have to do on a weekly basis, depending on your bunny, is groom them. Now, with my younger rabbits, I honestly don't have to groom them once a week if it's not during a molting season, so like when they're shedding really bad. But with my older rabbit, Lulu, who's about 10 and a half years old, I do have to groom her at least once a week, if not more, just because she cannot groom herself at all, which means her fur always looks like she's molting. It's very unsettled, very odd looking. And that's simply because she has such bad arthritis that she cannot lick herself and groom herself like younger rabbits can. So for that reason, I do groom Lulu about once a week. 
sometimes more, sometimes it's daily. It really depends on, you know, how she's doing and what her fur looks like. And some of you guys might have to groom more often depending on the breed of rabbit you have. I know Angoras take a lot more work than short-haired rabbits, so it definitely depends on your breed, their age, their health conditions, all of this stuff. So that's basically it for today's video. I really hope you guys enjoyed and learned something. Leave a comment down below if you guys want to see a monthly care routine as I would be happy to do that as well. Thank you guys so much for watching and I will see you very soon on a new video. Bye!